everybody. I um, got another update for you on the coronavirus. A lot has gone has been going on since last video. I just thought I'd just make a little short video here of what's been going on and what changes have been going on since last video. I think it was on Wednesday. Uh, just about probably about four hours ago, uh, Mike DeWine did officially announce that we are now Ohio is now under a shelter in place which means anybody who is like not in health care or isn't doesn't work anywhere that's essential has to stay home um places that are essential to us like grocery stores pharmacies uh gas stations uh things like that are still open because they are essentials um restaurants are still open but again just for carry out and drive through uh, those are still open um, but anything that is essential is open everything else is pretty much closed but yeah we are now under a shelter in place starting at 11 59 monday night and it is supposed to last through april i think six is um when it's supposed to end hopefully so that's what's been going on that was just announced a few hours ago um again that is for anybody who does not work at for an essential um <clears throat> place um is required to stay home uh they said that we can still like go out exercise um, you can still go out for walks, things like that, but they say to try and stay home as much as possible and only go out if you absolutely necessarily need to. Uh, let me see here. Um, right now, we Ohio has 316 confirmed cases of the coronavirus. Uh, so far, there have been three deaths in Ohio due to the coronavirus um, they just announced too with um, with daycares I think starting Thursday daycares are required to only have six kids in each room of the daycare um, I don't think they're gonna be shutting down but that could definitely change but Starting Thursday, daycares are only allowed to have six kids in each room. Mm, as far as that goes, I'm sure there are a lot more things that are going on. A lot more cancellations, but it is getting down to the nitty gritty. This is still only the beginning. We This will probably go on for another few months of this but we will just have to play it by ear see how things go um this is just the beginning so we'll just have to again just play it by ear um it's going to be a very very busy week at work for me um i'm going to be doing things that i never thought i would be doing in my health in my health field but I just even though it's scary but at the same time it is part of my job and as I mentioned in my video a couple, couple videos ago I am in health care and part of the health care is going out there and trying to nip this thing in the butt and prevent it from being um, <clears throat> prevent it from being spread out um, and yeah, I'm one of those people where I, I can't stay home. I got to go out there and face this thing and kick it in the butt. And yeah, it is a scary time. And yeah, it, I am a little bit scared. But not just because of that, but just it, it's a big, just the fact that it's a big change for me. Um, but I know it's it's part of the job. I know I can do this. I'm not the only one, but 
I mean, somebody's got to go out there and do, do what they need to do, but, um, again, that's just part of the job, and I'm so sorry if I look a little bit tired and things like that, um, and, again, it, for all of us here in America, it has been one heck of a ride. I mean, I think we're all feeling the same thing, just having to stay home and not being able to go out and do anything in our normal lives, and and it's just it's very limited right now and it sh it definitely is a crazy time um i did forget to mention in the last video um i know i mentioned that there was a possibility that andy could be sent home he actually just found out a couple days ago he got a letter from his um boss and it turns out that what he does for a living actually is considered a essential for um, <clears throat> an, an, essential, an essential job duty. So, luckily for both of us, we we are working. So a Andy is not going to be sent home, which is which is great. I mean, I never would have expected with what he does for a living that'd be something to do. But they said they do consider that as essential. So. Lucky for both of us. I mean, yeah, we are working. And <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm just, it's it's just a lot going on right now. Um, but I just want to reiterate to everybody, especially with this going on, there are people who have to go out and work on this. People have essential jobs, and it is a crazy time. So we just ask all of you who have to stay home or have a job that is not essential, please, for our sakes, definitely stay home. We we cannot spread that enough. Please stay home and allow us to do our jobs and be safe so that way we can protect you guys. And I know I'm kind of tearing up a little bit, so I do apologize. Um... <clears throat> but yeah, I I can't say enough to stay home, wash your hands, and stay stay healthy, get plenty of sleep, do what you can, only go out if it's absolutely necessary. But yeah, just stay home and let us our healthcare workers, um police officers, firefighters, um, anybody who is a part of the, who is essential to what is going on right now, please just stay home for them so we can fight this and basically save you guys from having to get this. All right. I just keep saying, I know that it's, it's crazy. It, it really is crazy. I mean, all weekend, all I've pretty much done is take walks and just stay inside. And that's pretty much what our lives are going to be right now. And it's a crazy world right now. But, I mean, like I said, just stay home for us. That's all we ask. Just be smart and stay home. Can't really ask much more of that. And I don't know how much, like, video time we're going to be able to put up on the channel. I mean, if something comes up, we can definitely tape something. I know I could probably do some more cooking ones for you guys. Because that seems like that will be the only thing I can really do that's able, that I'm able to do right now. I don't know if Andy has anything planned. Um, speaking of Andy... I'm sure you guys have found out that um, Kings Island is definitely not going to open on time. They were playing, they were going to open on April 11th, and I'm sure you guys heard that that their opening day has now been postponed as of now to mid-May. So um, I know Andy's a little bit upset by that, but we both knew it was going to happen. So he was planning on going there opening day to ride the new. Um, roller coaster Orion, but as of now, that definitely has been postponed to mid-May. But of course, like any day, you don't know what could happen, and 
what can change. So, um, Andy is just going to have to wait another couple of months before he can get a new video out for that. So, just keep staying tuned. Um, we will get um, video as best as we can. Of course, if you guys have any suggestions on what kind of videos you want to see from us that are acceptable to what's going on right now, we can um, definitely just comment below. We can definitely make exceptions to that, and we will do our best. If there's anything you like to see from us, we can definitely do that. Um, but right now, it is getting more limited and limited each day. Um, so I just wanted to give this quick little update on what's been going on right now since Wednesday. Again, a lot's been been changing day by day, but we'll make sure that we give you guys updates as best as we can. Um, I was planning on going to the grocery one day this week to kind of give you guys an update of what the grocery stores look like. If you guys do want to see an update of what they look like from the last time I do it, definitely comment down below, and I can definitely make a date to try and go out there. But um, this weekend, I just kind of wanted to stay put. Um, I really had no absolute need to go to the grocery, so I just decided to postpone that and just go another weekend. But if you go, if you guys do want to see another update on that, definitely comment down below. Um, I would like to hear if you guys want to see that. Um, I saw that it got a lot of good views and it got a lot of comments on it. So, um, yeah, if you definitely want to see an update, comment below and I'll be more than happy to do that. And again, if you have any suggestions on what kind of videos you would like Andy and I to see or um, like us to do, again, comment below. We would like to take your suggestions. And again, if there's a recipe that you want me to try out and show you guys, um, again, comment below. Uh, we are definitely up for any suggestions right now, especially with us. Um, now being stuck at home, um, we, we can take whatever we got. Okay, well, I think that's going to do it for us on this update. Um, just remember to like and subscribe to our channel. Um, just ring, And also to ring that um, notification bell if you want to get updates for when we upload new videos. And um, again, just like and subscribe. And I'm going to read it again. Please stay at home. And don't go out unless you absolutely need to for any essential. Just stay home for us. That is all we are asking. Stay home for us and we will keep you guys safe. And that is a promise we are willing to take for you guys. Alright, that's going to do it. Remember to like and subscribe. And we will see you guys next time. And feel free to comment below on any suggestions that you may have for us for any videos. Right, that's going to do it. We'll see you guys next time. And that is that.